Hey guys, it's Rene. So for this, I started a bit backwards because first I filed my nails square and painted them in white. Changed my mind about the shape and just wanted to make them like round or almond shape. For that, I'm going to be using some nail clippers and I'm going to be cutting the corners. So I'm just getting rid of like the square. So pretty much just start with that. Then I'll file my nails to just make them round or almond shape. It's actually really easy to make this shape. You just have to file enough until you like the shape. And one tip that I have for you for this kind of like shape is is by cutting and filing you're gonna get rid of a lot of nail so you just have to start with a longer nail that you can like function and then just go from there because with all the filing and everything the nails will become a lot shorter i'm gonna be using some acrylic paint for this pink and purple in my brush and it's actually really easy i'm going to be dipping my brush into the paint and then just paint like a straight line on each side so I decided to go for purple and pink. I switched in between nails. So for one, I started with purple, then pink. Then for the next nail, it was pink, purple, then purple and pink, and so on and so forth. Then I went for the pink to make it into a point overlapping my pink. Then I'm going to be taking a bobby pin. I'm going to be opening this. I do have a DIY showing you how I made a dotting tool. Like for the size of that, I'm not in my like usual spot where I film. So I didn't bring that tool with me. But check it out. It's actually really easy and handy to have it if you paint dots but i'm going to be making a tiny heart on my ring finger first painting two dots one one next to the other one and then using this dotting tool i do have the DIY showing you how i made it and how i decorated this but i'm going to be dragging those dots down towards the center turn this into a heart if you want to go for a bigger size heart just choose a bigger dotting tool now i'm going to be sealing this beauty using this it's actually a base a clear base but i'm going to be using this as a top coat because i have nothing else and this one works for me for this adding two coats and lighting dry in between coats and don't forget the back the back is really important because we're using acrylic paint and acrylic paint can be easily removed with water and to make your design last for when you take a shower and you wash your hands and stuff and this is the final look the final result i removed like the french tip on my ring finger because i got overwhelmed with all the like design that I had going on in that nail that's a personal preference so i just preferred it like this if you want the, like the french part tip in the heart or you know feel free to add a heart on each nail it's pretty much up to you but i just wanted to show you this really cute and easy design i'm obviously not a nail technician or an expert i'm like a regular person but i like to have pretty nails but i wanted to share this design for valentine's because i thought it was cute it's actually better than what i had in my mind and i really hope you like it too because i really liked it and i think it's cute hopefully you do too and if you do don't forget to give this a thumbs up let me know down below and share this check out more nail care that i have on my channel subscribe for more thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye